Hello again, everyone. It is your Black Knight. And we've been working on these these land missions for the cargo, the, uh, the smuggler's cargo. And I've got to say, they're a lot better. A lot better than the air missions. This is... Some are better than others. But even the ones that, you know, are somewhat time-consuming aren't that time-consuming. They really, You could really do them. I don't know how many we're going to show off here. We're in medias res here. This is the one where you have to supposedly just go pick up the stuff from Rooster, but then it all goes sideways. But it's not bad. My goal here is to get the, the baseball cap you get for getting 500k worth of stuff. So I'm going to sell it, you know, nine credits. Not the, not the, the big money stuff. Right now it's double money on the crates which had a, a permanent triple money boost so it, it gives you an idea of alright so nine crates will get me with the double money to 500k 540,000 or 60k each because I'm not really engaging any bonuses I'm using rooster to supplement Raiju, if you have the Raiju, which I would highly recommend you get the Raiju, it's... Oh, wait, wait, whoa, 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 what's, what's, what's that? It, the missiles suck, to be fair. You get here quicker, but if you're going to actually fight stuff, you're, you're almost better off with the, uh, the Sparrow. Because you can just pound the crap out of it once you get there. I could bring in a tank. But that is this. This could be a little ride to review too. Look how bad these missiles are. Can't hit hardly anything. Like it's a fast plane. But you know. I should be getting saw they're right below me, okay. Finally lighting up. I can't imagine this would be any good in a dogfight. Like if you're if you're using missiles. Because they just don't want to track. I've had them hit I've had to miss stationary targets on the ground. Did we shoot down that helicopter, or...? Why, why'd those close up? That's... Under no circumstances should that happen. That's not how an F-35 works. If you're in hover mode, the door's gotta be open. See, we're into search the crash site mode here. is just not hitting. Finally. Where is the proverbial stuff? Where do you put the plane down? And we're shooting cops. That's the problem. See that? Stay, it's a stationary bad guy. Still missed him. These are not not good missiles. Like, do I let the cops kill this guy? Come on. 
I'm not. Do we finally get it? Okay, I see something shiny. I see the shiny thing. I don't think you could pick it up with the plane. Oh, you did, okay. You can't, the, the last few times I've tried that, well, I, I didn't put the gear down, I just snuggled into it. Maybe that's the difference. You find the cargo? Great. Now just lose the cops and get it back here. Right, you losing the cops. Let's see, this should help. There you go. Stealth mode. See, the Raju is terribly useful. It's just that it's got really terrible missiles. And I realize they don't want to make it overpowered. And it's probably a good thing it has terrible missiles. And I'm not very good with the gun, so it's... They're not bad, though. Weak explosives. I think that's the difference. If you l try to land on top of the cargo with the gear, it seems like you got too much ground clearance and you have to get out and do it. But if you do something silly like this belly flop. Belly flop on it, then you can get it. Alright. Yeah, if you get if you sell 500k, you're supposed to get a hat. If you do this, and then, hey, this is the best week to do it if it's double money. It'll take a lot longer. Take twice as long. Um, why isn't my plane in here? Okay, if you can leave it out there. It's parked in front, I guess. It wasn't destroyed. I am gonna repark the Avenger because I'm not doing any of those those other missions again. Probably there's a couple that we could, you could. <laughs> Now that was some first-class damage control. To be honest with you, I'm worried about how hard Rooster's going to celebrate. I'm glad they're able to get Ron back for this one. I thought he got really the, sh the, the wrong end of the stick, let us say. <coughs> In the... See, now we're up to 180, so we've got a couple here, a couple here. So we go back to source, alternate the chemicals. Go to the cooldown. If I was going max bonus, I wouldn't. And, you know, once the, the, dub, the double money part is done, I don't know, maybe I'll, maybe I'll try to get a bonus on one of them at some point. Let's see what we get here. Like, once I get my 500 and my 500, I've already got one. Where'd the plane go? Hey, so I was thinking, it's been a while since we asserted our dominance in the world of air freight. I say it's time we sent a message to the competition. We're going to break into a hideout, steal some stuff, and make it very clear who's at the top of the pyramid. Us. Well, you, but I'm like one step down. About them, anyway. Where is my right? There it is. You can use the, uh, the Walton to drive all the way there. That's an option. Or you could use it to drive to your plane. It feels pretty good for a pickup. It would be more reasonable to throw something in the back of a pickup than to throw it in, like, a fighter jet. But, you know, we're, we're going for effectiveness here, and to say that this is a little bit quicker than a Walton is, you know, the epitome of understatement. It's, it's quite zippy. Not as zippy as the actual difference between an F-35 and a uh, pickup truck, but, you know, still zippy. It is kind of nice that a lot of these missions have non-violent uh, options. But even if it's a little more time-consuming, or even a lot more time-consuming, there's something low stress about that. Makes it a little bit more uh, more fun to play. Better role play. You're, you're, you're putting one over on people. This is one of those. But it's a lot better than like the 15 or 20 minutes or 30 minutes to get one, one cargo 
that you do with the air missions. It's, you know, this is much more doable. Much more, I think I can hop on the game, grab a cargo. I only have 10 minutes or really, or 15 minutes to play. Okay, this is this one. You're gonna find this place is locked up with some pretty heavy shutters. I swung by earlier to check it out, and lucky for us, it's all powered off a generator nearby. Take that out, and you should be all clear. I mean, unless you have something that could fit under the door. First of all, pretty good park job there, if I do say so myself. And by the way, the I've been watching all kinds of guides on this. This is this this video is not meant to be a guide. This is just a giving you my opinion. There's a lot of good guides out there. You know, you can check out where am I at here? Check out the the people in the description there. The the GTA reference library. They got you covered. Now. Look at that cute remote control car. I love it. Let's blow it up. Next to... Come on, where is it? Where's the little red arrow? Oh, there you go. They move it around. It wasn't there last time. And what button is it? Q. Now the next, for this one, to find the, uh, the the generator, you have to go. Well, maybe it moves around too, so that could be an issue. Is it, does the generator move around? Yeah, it was up. He, it was up here last time. This this particular one, it's a little bit tricky to, to find the generator. Oh wait, that's that, isn't it? There you go. If you get close enough to it, it lights up, but it looks pretty obvious. Booing! Hey, we have really good ankles. No need for the gun, really, because no one's going to bother me. They just, just learned not to, to leave their doors ten inches open, which I don't know why that would be happening anyway, but I like the mission, so it's, it's really okay. Shoop, doop, doop. Of course, I had to go with the the uh, paint job that matches my outfit for this one. And here, transition, take off. Now the plane's very enjoyable to fly. It gets you there quick. Like, it's the fastest plane by a lot. In this game. I mean, saying the thing goes 200 miles an hour in real life is pointless. But in this game, 200 some odd something, I forget what it is, 267? I don't know. That's a bruffy question. Bruffy 1322. I have to look. Is, is, this, which, uh, is this the Sunday for the big G, Fred? I might be, I might be down for that. No, it shouldn't be. It shouldn't be that. I don't think it's this weekend. I think that probably be a couple more weeks. I'll check his schedule. Stop it. I've been getting that as of late. I don't know why. I did get a notice from Verizon, that, not Verizon, from uh, Comcast that they had some maintenance they were going to be doing. So they they found some issues in the network. So maybe once they get that done, I forget what dates that was. Maybe things will improve. There's not enough floor space for your. Oh, okay. It's in store. Okay, we have to move this Avenger out. And it's and you know what? That's pretty close. 
I don't have to go across the map for this one. Let's get rid of this. <laughs> we did it! I consider that message sent! Because in this case, rather than the Polito Bay facility, I've got the one right over here. Hop on over. Of the repeatable missions, you know, the ones on the right side of the menu, the, the, the one in the middle is repeatable, I think. Some of them a little bit long. If you like shooting stuff, they're great. But nothing's calling to me for a little while yet. May eventually throw some liveries on this as we unlock them, but now what? Fastest way back thruster. In the good thruster, not the mini thruster. So now we have floor space. And that'll be my personal vehicle. I'll have to reset that at some point. But yeah, we. I wasn't getting that error before. It was parking, so I don't know what happened, but... Do, 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 do. Get this. Storage! Right, you. Front and center. What else can we put out? What will what would be the other things that might still be useful? I, mean, I can't ima I can't really imagine like this is this is a unique kind of vehicle. It has unique abilities that I don't, I've never even really built that up. But like would I use the Kula when I could use this? Definitely has better weapons. So maybe. Pyro, no. Oh, sorry, it's a little Luxor. Here, yeah, that can be. The Savage is useful. In the Strike Force. Strike Force is arguably a better fighter. In a, in a, in a you know, an actual fight. Need to have the savage there. Tula, love my Tula. I just love the Tula. Yeah, I think that's I think that's pretty much all we can put out. Yeah, we'll put the way the uh, let's put away that half million. Just uh that we have a good total of where we're at. Still, this has been the most expensive DLC for me. I mean, I've gone through... I went through 75 million on this pretty much. Alright, we might be ready to move on this thing. No, we're not. Why, do you say? What was 75 million? Well, the panic FOMO before they, uh... They took away all those vehicles. I didn't know what I, what I was going to miss out on. I bought a ton of cars, a ton of cars, a lot of which I haven't built up yet. And uh, you know, just so you know, I am going back. I'm gonna have to t probably every time I do a video, I'll mention this. Uh, anytime I do a video where I'm gonna do a car build video, 
uh, card is unavailable. I'm going to explain my logic for doing it because, you know, initially I didn't want to promote anything that you couldn't get. So here it is. Two rival groups of black marketeers are out there breaking bread. And to seal their newfound friendship, they're making a big trade. How? Heartwarming. <laughs> so heartwarming, I suggest we ruin it. I got a couple of ideas. Option one, the classic. You head straight down there and kill everyone without so much as a word. Option two, the sneaky. You intercept trailer A on the way to the deal. Take it there yourself. Swap it for the infinitely more valuable trailer B and drive out of there like nothing happened. Up to you. Okay, where is the trailer? There we go. I'm using the thruster rather than the ride do because it was there. And it might be a little bit easier to drop in front of this thing and stop it without having to actually just kill the guys. It's a little bit quicker in, in hover mode. And a little bit more maneuverable. Not perfect, but still... Hey! That was definitely, you know, that, that was good. Git. And by the way, one of the nice things about these, a lot of these missions, both, uh, you know, from the missions from the Avenger and the missions here, is that when you, uh, when you do them, you get an outfit. Like, I've equipped the dock worker outfit. You get the dock worker outfit from just doing this mission. So when you get through all of them, you get all these different disguises. It's really, that's, I like that. That's really cool. So, so far, I have to say, land missions here, the best part of this DLC, still bitter about them, you know, removing all those cars from the in-game website and the fact that I had to burn up all of my garage space. But I think what I'm going to do, and this is back back to that conversation. What I'm going to do is I'm going to do the build videos even for the cars that are unavailable. And then it's going to be a matter of do we keep it or not? Is it cool enough to keep? And there are a couple cars I bought that you can still get that I probably won't. But, you know, if it's cool enough. Like the Bobcat. The Bobcat, you know, is still available. Why? I don't know. It has got to be a lesser used vehicle. Just, just amplifies the lie that was uh, what they put in the, the newswire. Utter lies. They took away a lot of cool stuff that people would want and use all the time. So they could resell it. But, you know, I was thinking about this. Well, I want Bruffy to take down all his videos on the, the cars that are no longer available just so that he's not... No, that's useful information. And if I do a car build and you look at it, you say, well, gee, that's kind of boring. Why would I want that? And then maybe I can remove the FOMO. So, that's, you know, it's, it's going to be a mixed bag because some stuff's going to be really cool. A lot of cars, I mean, again, this is another thing that I considered. A lot of cars like the, the Tegon, I race all the time. Well, am I going to never race the Tegon again because I have it and you can't get it? It, it, becomes, it becomes very cumbersome to try and control what's going on. So, my... My initial knee-jerk reaction of anger, I have said, well, on a practical basis, I might as well create the content. And then make as many statements about how I hate FOMO as possible in every one of those. So, I mean, you know. We can, we can do this. We can do this in a way that does not promote the FOMO. FOMO, why do you have to do this FOMO? The FOMO sucks. So yeah, this is probably slower by a lot than taking a ride you out there, blasting the crap, or, or even a sparrow, blasting the crap out of everybody and just taking the uh, the thing, taking taking the trailer and driving it back, or even blowing it up and then taking the cargo with the uh, sparrow or the or ride you. Whichever you could do that, I'm almost certain. But there's something there's something kind of enjoyable about just driving there sneakily driving away and not having it's you know it's the same people we blast all the time it's the right you know it's, it's the lost and usually and somebody else 
it's the gangs that we normally blow up on a regular basis and I think I've talked to you about my theory that everybody in this game even the pedestrians respawn everybody responds and I think I think you can even you know apply that to stuff like um, you know, Freelander. Like, you know, a lot of, I bet you a lot of people killed Freelander in their single player playthrough. I didn't even get that far. But he's there. Now you can say, well that means that the canon uh the canon ending for that is that Michael doesn't kill him. By the way, spoiler alert if you haven't played this game from twenty thirteen. I won't go into the details. But okay, don't run anybody over. Excuse the truck driver. Excuse him. Please don't make me run you over. Because I'm trying to be professional here. Where's the other trailer? That's the other trailer. It's the brown one, usually. And there's other trucks if I screw this up, but... Okay, this is getting funny. My inability to back up. All right. They're pretty oblivious. All right, game. Be persnickety and with the physics. That's collect cargo, and then they think they think they're driving it back to their lockup. You got the other trailer? Okay. Just drive it carefully back to the hangar. Last thing we want is the damn thing on hitching. I think I think if I'd run that guy over, we would have gone they've all gone hostile and then problems. And that's it. Now we just drive. It's a long drive. Pretty much the length of the uh, the map here, but almost. You don't have to drive that carefully. Look what happens with the texture on this thing. That's it's like it's cycling through every possible look that should be on the uh, on this thing or something. I don't know exactly what that is. Yeah, that was a giant fan. I don't know what's what's like every possible texture cycles through on the roof. I don't know what's going on there. Interesting glitch. But yeah, so my plan right now is to go through a bunch of these. By the way, the land cell missions, you get, you're get you guaranteed one vehicle. So I mean, that's no longer trying to go back and get th you don't get the three Havoc impossible mission. It's it's much better. I will say, you know, the, um, the cell mission where you get the, 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 one, the only mission I've done so far, you get the armored weaponized Issy. And you're supposed to have to fly, you know, not fly. You have to drive through these different smoke, you know, markers because that's the path they want you to take. Those are just suggestions, as far as I can tell. You don't have to go that route, but it does seem quicker. I mean, it does seem like there. It's a it's a quicker shortcut usually than to what the uh, the map will give you. But you know, I agonized a bit longer over that than I should have when I first did that. So. No, it's not recorded. Matter of fact, the first time I tried to record it, this mission, the computer froze. Haven't had that happen in ages. I don't. I don't. I don't think my my grease has expired. So I think it was just a glitch between you know OBS and wherever I was at that moment. Something something spiked out. Some software issue. Knock on wood, hasn't happened again. Having said that, I'm just not going to get back. And again, I might be, you know, if you look at the glitch that's happening here on the back of the trailer, that might be part of it. I mean, what's that? It's like flames and fans and industrial things, and I don't know what's going on there. It could be you just get the wrong, the wrong little thing that comes up and it crashes the computer. So we're we're gonna have to hustle here. 
hope to make it back. That's all theoretical. I have no idea what's going on. None. Not even a little bit. Yeah, so when, when I'm evaluating the card, it's going to be like, all right, this is something. And every card now is in this book because they can just take anything off the website at any time. We have to realize that. What's up is not safe. So it's like you have to hold it in your hand and say, does this bring me joy? I forget what method that's called. And am I okay never driving this again? You know, Bobcat might be that, but I have to see once I get it all modded up. Is it is it fun? What about the stingers? I have like all the stingers on one character or another. Not the new one. I don't have the stinger, Italy GTO, Teddy Ruxpin, whatever it is. I, you know, it's, I'm not, I'm not getting that one. Number one, I don't have HSW. Never going to see the super high top speed. And I don't think they're giving it to us. I think there's something with PC that if they do HSW, it goes out of control. And therefore, we can't have HSW. I think that's that's what it is. They haven't figured that out yet. And by the way, ignore the pathing here. That can't be the faster way. It's certainly the way you could dump this thing in the water, I'm pretty sure. I have, I have not tried it, but I know my way around well enough by this point in the game. By the way, I'm like right now like 40 or some hours from 13,000. Much of which was idling, because I mean, if you're spending 48 hours idling stuff a lot of times just to sell, you know, your nightclub, you can build up hours quick. But I mean, I have been playing the game for several years here. Probably as long as you can, but I don't remember when I got the PC, PC version. I got the original 360 version, I really couldn't play because I only had regular cathode ray tube televisions at the time. That's how long ago that was. They're coming into their hangar. Low level base access track. And so I got the three. I did have a 360. It was unplayable with that low resolution. You just couldn't read anything. I eventually got the PC, transferred everything up, so I get the free cars and why not. But yeah, this is not compared to the other missions. That's a, that's a spaceship. What is going on with this, with this trailer? I've seen that before. It's not pertinent to this mission. Scooby-dooby-doo. And now you get, that is one of my outfits. I can select that. Hey, it's Ron! Kudos on your flawless execution of my flawless plan. We'll start unloading this baby now. And the one thing. Okay. And you can just rinse, lather, repeat this. It's not bad. See, how? where are we at? We're at 300k. My goal is only 500k. So, I mean, just to get the hat. Have a cooldown, do a land mission. So this should be easy. I have Rooster out bringing back some cargo for us. Go meet his plane at Sandy Shores and help him with the delivery. Okay, now we did, I'm going to just to mix this up to show you the difference. Sparrow is, is not a slouch. It's not as fast as a ride you, but it is not a slouch and the missiles are way better. And the Savage still has the original Death Ray explosive gun. Don't 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 flinch and shoot your own people. That's okay. They, they let you on the base. They're friendly. But like I'm doing these back to back, and I'm not annoyed. I'm not like, I wish this was over. I'm not, you know, that, that that was kind of the feeling I got from a lot of the other missions. But this, this is sweet. I'm 
I'm dealing with this okay. And you hear Rooster Freak coming up on Rooster Freaking Out in 5432. Crazy about the bucket heads. Crazy about the bucket heads. We have a big fat deuce of a problem, people. I got hit by a bunch of bogeys just as I was on the final mile. Think I made good. I ejected, but the cargo roll went down with my bird. Reckon you ought to get to it before the bad guys do. Transponder signals should still be accurate. Shit! Someone's after us! We gotta get down there! Now, that's interesting that he's call it, my call sign's Buckethead when you consider, you know, I'm the Black Knight. Invoking the whole Monty Python Black Knight, which they kind of wore buckets, you know. I don't know how, you know, medievally accurate those were, but... Buckethead, I'll take that. That that kind of works. You know, compare this to the Ride You's missions. Ride You! Just absolute... Just arcing and sparking into everybody. Okay, I'm kind of not fly flying very well. Let's let's stabilize. There you go. Give it even a little bit of a good chance. I think we want to stay out of the yellow, and then we won't get the cops on us. Okay, I think they're all dead. There's the stuff. Can we get this with the with a touch of the I don't know. I'm bouncing around a lot here, I'm hurting myself. I'm a little too wild. I'm I'm rushing it a little too much. Alright, we probably could get it, but I'm just gonna get out and get it. Why why mess around? We're smoking a little, but not enough, I don't think. That was my sloppiness. Now just lose the cops and get it back here. Now the ride is better because I can just go into stealth and lose the cops, but you know. All right, let's do this. Let's invoke the ride you. Invoke. I will say this, that paint scheme does help in situations like this. Where is it? Right there. And we've already lost the, uh, the heat. But this thing I, is, is starting to die. And now it's dead. Deliver the chemicals to the hangar. That's okay, because I got a ride you too. And that resets the timer on the sparrow in case I need it, so. And the, 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 the visuals on this plane. I mean, I'll be honest, the F-35 is a really cool thing. I am critical of how much how much mechanical action goes on when it goes from VTOL. I mean, it goes into full Starscream Transformer kind of mode there with the everything aiming down and aiming up, and I worry about mechanical failure on that, but just my engineering side coming through. But that won't happen in a video game, I don't think, so we should be fine. I love the, the green highlights though, that's... I don't know, you know, it's a funny thing. I wonder... 
like how how much fun are you having watching this? Because it's an it's an interesting thing. Like I think sometimes I think how much fun I'm having can be inversely inversely proportional. I can talk inversely proportional to how much fun you're having because if I'm suffering it's funnier. Whereas if I'm just having a good time playing the game, well, what's you know, is, is that watchable? I don't know. So now this should just park inside. There should be enough room. Yeah. Whee! I don't think that's supposed to come through like that, but okay. <laughs> now that was some first class damage control. To be honest with you, I'm worried about how hard Rooster's gonna celebrate. Rooster doesn't seem to be, you know, it takes a it takes a long time for Rooster to deliver that extra little bit of cargo there. So I mean I think I might hit nine before he ever gets back. Source Narconotics. It doesn't really matter what unless you're going for the bonuses. Hey, so I was thinking, it's been a while since we asserted our dominance in the world of air freight. I say it's time we sent a message to the competition. We're gonna break into a hideout, steal some stuff, and make it very clear who's at the top of the pyramid. Us! Well, you, but I'm like one step down. About them, anyway. And, you know, this is hopefully a different location. Next request available in a minute. I don't know, we'll wait a minute, we'll talk. Let's talk. We got 29. It's not gonna take 29 if I get my radio out here. That's a pretty hefty cooldown there on this. You know, is it four minutes or something like that? You would think by now I should be able to. I could call in the sparrow. I could do the sparrow, but I think we'll actually save a minute. 45 seconds. We can wait 45 seconds talking together, can't we? What do we want to talk about? Like, when am I going to do the build videos? I don't know. Not, it's it's going to happen. i got a lot of cars. My goal had been, just out of sheer bitterness, to get back to 175 million, which is where I was before this whole thing started. But, you know, I don't know that I want to make that a priority. I got, I got 100 million. Maybe I'll have a little bit less than that with the uh, all these builds I'm going to do. But, you know, not a lot I want to buy. There's like being four or five cars from the DLC I'm going to get. I don't have but a few parking spaces. So unless I, you know, reduce the fleet a bit, get some money back, you know, half my money back on whatever junk I don't decide to keep. I think I got rid of the Saddler I bought because I already had a Saddler. Didn't realize it. Dumped a couple of pickups. I mean, it was just a matter of, eh, they're still available, so we'll just use that as a parking space. And again, it's like, am I going to use this? And probably not. But does it decorate my garage adequately? That's what's, you know. For some stuff, like with the Stingers, it would be different, you know, back in the day when Ruffy would actually come to a PC. And you'd have to, if you wanted to race with them, if you could get in. Then, uh, you had to have the cars available. But now, he, he's only on 8th gear or, fit or 5, or, you know, Project Homecoming. This is the same one. There's a couple other versions of this where it's easier. We're doing the frigid one again. Probably... I think, where are we? No, maybe not. You're gonna find this place is locked up with some pretty heavy shutters. 
I swung by earlier to yeah, check different. it out, okay. and lucky for us, it's all powered off a generator nearby. Take that out, and you should be all clear. I mean, unless you have something that could fit under the door. Where is it? Where are we at here? Come on. Now we're going to the highway. All right, let's just come down. Okay, this is a different one. That's good. Where is the door? Let's, where is... Where are we going? What the heck? Oh, there it is. Okay, the big arch door. Okay. Inventory. I'll see bandito. RC Bendito. It's the RC Bendito. Where's the little box on the wall? There we go. RC Bendito. The boof. No. Oh my god, there's an explosion! Okay, so where is the, the, the generator? I can scooch under there, come on. Where is the generator? On the other side? Are we on the other side? Are we dealing with an other side kind of thing? Hey, hit me up on later. It's a little inconvenient to walking around here and finding the generator, but we do have a ride, you. Okay, hook the wing, but we're all right. We're gonna be fine. It's a very tough plane. And it can fly upside down. I know that. I'm hooked here. Come on. Did we break it? We're starting to break it. Okay, let's try this. Oh, I hit the wrong button. Totally hit the wrong button. That looks workable, doesn't it? The way it landed? I'm under an overpass, but we'll have to work with that. It's a little hurt. Okay. Search the area for the generator. Now we were stuck on which side? <laughs> that one. So let's go on this side. I think that's it. It was. I think this will hold up well enough to get us back, and then it'll be fixed when we get back. You know what else we could do, and this is just occurring to me, from the other side, Call in the bandito again, drive through, and then blow up the generator with the bandito. That's what we should have done. 
That's the ticket right there. Let's get some altitude so this thing can cough a little bit without having it be a problem. That's the way you do it. If the generator's not now, there, there is some times you have to climb a ladder to get the generator. But in that case, that would have been the, that would have been absolutely the path, as opposed to like wrecking the airplane. You know, that's Charlie will have to work on this over like a millisecond, and it'll be fine. Because video games, video game logic. I may, because my, my goal is get nine and then sell as soon as possible, because, you know, that's how that usually goes. But this is, I got a lot of time here. I should at least wait for Rooster to bring back that one extra thing so I, don't, I, can, I can focus on narcotics and stuff like that. Plane's fixed. Hurry. Rooster, you're taking forever. I'm gonna reach my goal. Cause I don't know. Maybe if, if I <laughs> we did it! I consider that message sent. So there they are, the, the the critical planes. The ones I've chosen are still relevant. <laughs> And the Savage, I don't technically need to take a floor space with. But. We're at 420, yeah. So we need another batch of chemicals here. That'll take it to 480. Theoretically, Roosters would, make, would tip us over if he would just show up. Ugh. So this should be easy. I have Rooster out bringing back some cargo for us. Go meet his plane at Sandy Shores and help him with the delivery. Let's see, vehicles, this time. I thought about the Savage. Akula, I want to see how, how relevant. Oh, well, good. I don't have to drive to it. It's right there. The homing missiles. There we go. Maybe the Savage next, if we get this a couple times in a row here, then we'll take the Savage out and just paint them with the the uh, explosive death beam. Although it has pretty good missiles, I think. Might be the same missiles, but faster firing. And savage is pretty savage. And this is one of the nice things about this. Boy, it does feel slow, doesn't it, compared to the ride? Even the Sparrow. Is that you do have crazy bird to bucket head. We have a big fat deuce of a problem, people. I got hit by a bunch of bogeys just as I was on the final mile. Think I made good. I ejected with the cargo rolling down with my bird. Reckon you ought to get to it before the bad guys do. Transponder signal should still be accurate. Shit! Someone's after us! We gotta get down there! And, you know, you have so many options for vehicles on this, it does allow you to keep it interesting, which is nice when you're grinding. And 
Hello. Let's try and stabilize this a little bit. Yeah, these are the good misses. And we have the, uh, st the stealth capability with this to escape the police, so that's good. Yeah, the cool is still relevant, I think, don't you think? Anyone still alive? Alright, where is the silvery shiny bit? Silvery shiny bit. There's the silk the shiny bit. Shiny bit. It's in a really inconvenient place as far as landing with the, and getting it with the uh, thing of a bob. I'm still flashing even though they see me because stealth mode. You find the cargo? Great. Now just lose the cops and get it back here. There we go. We're stealthy. We're flying away. It's it's faster on blowing things up, slower on getting back and forth. It's it's up to you whether you think one's much better or more fun than the other. The overpowered feeling of just you know raining death from above is much better on the Akula or even the Sparrow than the uh, the Raiju, but the Raiju is zippy. And yeah, I think we're going faster than we realize because we are gaining altitude here. This uh, this plane does have a tendency of just gaining altitude. This helio copter. Come on. Feels like we're flying through really thick soup. Let's go. Let's get back on the ground. And for some reason you you were a masochist and wanted to do this in a public session, I'm in an invite only, stealth comes in handy. I might sell in a public one of these days, because I'm not I'm not gonna do it try to get my five hundred, because I really just want to get my five hundred. Get the cap. And unlock the the unlock. And you know what, for all I know, it's a cap I already have. But who knows? I mean it's just, you know, I'm not I don't pay that I don't change my clothes that often with this game. You know, it's We Shot up a bit. You know, let's let's see after this. <laughs> now that was some first class damage control. To be honest with you, I'm worried about how hard the rooster's gonna celebrate. So let's let's do this. Just to help ourselves back up. I don't think there's a glass of green juice in there. It really needs one. There are snacks. You can snack up in there. But there's no real way to take cover. And that that, that is an outfit, outfit change as well. Is there green? Can we something we could... No. We should be able to eat the fruit too. That would be cool. And let's go. Dooby 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 doo. We're close. There's alcohol, but there's no green juice. Makes it less than perfect. See, right now we're at 480. 
Not quite enough for a cap. They're both cooling down? Why would they both be in the identical cooldowns? Because I, I, I flipped, uh, whatchamacallit? Well, fine. You know, we're getting something random from Rooster anyway. Let's get some medical supplies. We're not going to go to 25 and 25. You ready? Okay. We're trying to stay one step ahead of some rival smugglers in the area. I'm thinking a little break-in, possibly some shooting, then we steal their stuff. Sound good? I mean, why alter a winning formula? Okay. Let us call up the Raiju again. Where are you, Raiju? Raiju, Raiju, Raiju! Raiju. Raiju, 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 Raiju. Should I drive the Walton all the way there just to see if the stuff ends up in the back of the pickup? Yes, probably someday. Not today. Today, time is of the essence. And Rooster is very, very slow. Here they come to snuff the Rooster. Let's roll. We're flying. And after I get after I get my cap unlocked, I'm probably gonna take a break from the game for a few days like ton of editing. I mean, I've got like at least three videos here that I'm going to be putting together on all these topics. Still have by this point, I still haven't even edited the first look at the uh, the original missions. You know, the yeah, project whatever it was, overthrow. So, I've got editing to do. There's a lot there, but by the time you see this, this will obviously be done. This will be the last video I'm editing. It's the same lockup, okay. It's back to the frigid again, okay. So I did a bit of reconnaissance earlier, and unless you have something small enough to make it under the shutter door, we're gonna have to open it. So I did a little more digging and There's found it's connected to a generator. Destroy that and it should pop right, All right. open. What if we what if we said the heck with it? And don't worry about the you know, just pop it. That will set off an alarm. Do I have gear? And now I do. So, there's the alarm. Can we get in and get out? Saving all that time. Welfare trash, I'm leaving in an F-35. Ride you away. Bye. So that saves time, but you know, it's a, is it is it worth the extra minute to uh to blow it so you don't have to deal with everybody and shoot them? Yeah, probably, I don't know. It's up to you. I think I think I will. I'll go through the extra effort. That saved a lot of time, though. It saved a lot of time. That might have been that might have saved us five minutes. I don't even know, but we'll see. You could you could scroll back and forth, but that that was very time saving. So it is if you're doing it really truly hardcore and not role playing it and trying to do all the tricks. And that can go wrong. You can get killed and end up in a firefight and surrounded by people and blah, blah, blah. Q. 
I thought that was like a 48 minute thing. Have I been playing for longer than 48 minutes? No. My phone's on the charger. I can't even. I don't want to flip flip here. Okay. It'd be funny if I was doing this whole thing and talking about all this and not recording. I'm, I'm okay with that, really. I guess it would be okay and I could make a different video. Another toy. This is. The main thing is get the baseball cap. Consider that message sent. Hey, he's back. So we got our little bonus thing here. Again, I'm not going to use. I'm not going to use him. You know, well, first of all, I'm not going to probably use this character to grind these. This is, you know, he's more of a racer. I'm using him now because he's visually interesting. You know, ooh, right through the spine on that one. That bullet. So now when we go to sell, if he's back, where is the one? Shouldn't we have 10 now? I got a source. We're going to do one more. Because that didn't register for some reason. There should be another one there. Okay. Here's the deal. Thanks to my intelligence and foresight, I've got tabs on a salvage crew scouring the ocean floor for a smuggler boat that just went down. Apparently, they're on this massive barge using magnets to search for any highly valuable goods that were on board the wreck. I got a rough idea of where they might be working, so head over there and let's figure out how to steal their sunken treasure. I'm going to do this one just because, you know, we'll show this one off, I guess. I've actually said this one's a little bit too annoying. It's not horrible. It can be, but it's not... This might be your favorite part of the video. We never know. It depends on how much you're into the Shadow and Freud. It's a little bit cumbersome. But then again, with the right tools, not too bad. I will need to snack it up. So this again involves a lot of killing and then being shot at repeatedly and then some being in clunky vehicles while being shot at. What right below me? This is where going to require some precision. We've got the mediocre missiles to fire. Everything should come up in the reticle here. We'll try to at least save a boat. Can we land this thing? Okay, we've cleared where we're going to have boats. That's the last of, we need a boat. Then you go over here. I see no reason to have to shoot these people with bullets.
I did successfully land the sparrow on the barge, but this is a bit bigger. I don't want to hurt it. We do. We do. Actually, there's you. You could hurt it because it's a. Uh, you need to drive the other thing back or blow it up. We could try to blow it up and. Uh, And then blow it up and fly it home. We, let's try it. We can try that. Because I've got my 540. We can take some risks here. We left somebody? Someone got to live? What were you hiding behind? And you get this. this is the end! Yeah, well, kinda. No, I'm not. Yeah, if you had been quiet, I wouldn't have known you were here, and you could have just shot me. Screw you! Didn't, that didn't work out well for you, did it? No. Locate the switch was here the last time. What the heck? The switches move around too now? Great. Locate the big switch. You do it. Okay, it's on this side now. Release the cargo. Then it sinks. Oh my god, it doesn't float! What the heck? Da 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 da! Swoosh! <laughs> Swoosh! We get that, now we gotta get back to shore. Please say you found the cargo! Hey, I got a truck waiting nearby, and I really don't want to lose my deposit! Load everything in there, and drive it back to the hangar! Now, and you get, you know, you're getting just shot to bits whether you're deep or not. I don't remember which way this thing is faster. Above water or below. You'd think they would have a tough time shooting us, but no, no they don't. They have a great time shooting us. Stay frosty! Yeah, shoot it on! I can't shoot back. I can just be shot repeatedly. Uh oh, we're heading too far in. Yeah, I can't do that yet. This is shallow water, so there's not much you can do going underwater. Why is there just skim along, try not to beach it? Like or do whatever that was. We're on. Oh, we're on something. We're caught. See, well, I mean, this isn't. This isn't necessarily worse than the other one, but it is a little bit. Now they do have a nice little cutscene here. You know, how do we get this out of the truck? The answer is... Magic! Because you do, it just fades away. Magic! While we're being shot at, we just load a truck. Now let's go back to the ride here. I want to see something. If I lose it, fine. We need to know. This is a... Inquiring minds want to know kind of thing. We're ignoring the directions and flying back to my plane. Because obviously it takes a while to drive this thing back, but you can. 
and guys come in cars and they shoot at you too and you have to shoot at them and it's a it's a nice little chase but i want to know and now there's guys in cars coming after me now too so we're gonna have to get into the plane we're gonna have to do a bunch of things here Okay, so now, let's try something. All right, switch guns. Why, am I, why can't I switch guns? Yeah, this will work. Slowly. Look at this. That's how. <laughs> That's how bad the missiles are on this thing. Come on, give me explosive guns. There we are. I can't. I'm still still too close. Come on. Collect the archives. Okay, good. Can we do that from the plane? Do I have to knock the uh, the thing over? Okay, that's not a bad guy. That's just someone driving around. Bad guys will be coming. So this is infinitely better, I think. I almost, I'm almost dead. Ooh. Okay, we're snacked up. And then just to, just to frustrate them, this Jushue. That is a lot faster than coming back with the truck. Like a lot, a lot. And yeah, I had to suck down some snacks, but, you know, snacks are free. What the hell? Have we seen all the source missions? I think you might have. You're not gonna see all the cell missions today, let me tell you. That's, that's, that's gonna take a little bit. But we should have, with that one, we should have 11, because I did pay for one. The rooster's there. Or is that gonna show up after the sale, like the last time I did it? Rooster. Looks like everything made it back. Great diving, you little sea dog. Okay. Bye. Bye. Can we can we source from you again? Watch your step. Yeah, but we're not gonna. I'll be here. Catch you around. You're fine. Did I miss the thing where it arrived? It might be. It should be here if he's there. Is he Rooster Macaw? Was that right? Is it the double bird names? Did I read that right? It's only showing so in ten. I'm not. I'm not going to agonize over this. We go to sell. We got six hundred k. Sell everything. Land sell. This will. This will wrap up the video. Time for my favorite part of all of this: making money, preferably with no bullets flying around. Now the buyer feels the same way and wants you to make the deliveries at quiet spots around the city. 
Now this is the same sail mission I did before. On the first, I did my first sail mission, so I can I can show you the whole thing with the. Uh, maybe this is the only land sail mission. I don't know. There's got to be. Oh, do you think there'd be more than one? But they have access to the base. Let them through. Let me out. Bit of a drive. But it's not very much different than, you know, a weed sale when we have the 10 things and you don't have to get out of the car, so. And by the way, the 10 things doesn't reflect the fact that I have 10, I had 9 before. Still 10 drops. Still a rare, a rare use of the armored, uh, you know, arena war, arena war is he. I don't know why I don't personally use the Arena War stuff more just knocking around in free mode. Like, you'd think that would be the perfect stuff. Like, why don't I do that? Am I just too focused on the productivity of it all? Like, I have only so much time in the game, so like, a lot of times it's like, well, whatever the meta is, that's what I'm doing. I'm doing this to get a hat. And after this, now I'm, I've, I will have unlocked all of the things you can unlock before, you know, July 12th or whatever it is. And I do want to get those videos up so they're useful to you. You know, you can see some stuff if you so, so choose to do that. Got it. So I'll have, after, if this is, su is successful, which is an if. Mostly I think the only, the only enemy you have here is time. Unless it's not a half an hour. We do have a good amount of driving to do here. But this wasn't bad. I, I wasn't cutting it close last time. And I, I did fumble around a bit last time. Because I didn't understand what they meant by did I have to go through the little smoke things? And would they go away? Was it a checkpoint thing? And, and because it wasn't like a hard and fast checkpoint thing, it was kind of like, it's just a suggestion. So you kind of wait for something to happen and nothing does. So let's, let's, it's good that we're showing you this. So where is the... Not down there. I don't know if I've ever driven, driven down there. That's kind of... Please move out of the way. Oh, uh, your buyer marked the route he wants to take with flares. Guys, kind of a control freak. Control freak. If you ask me, I like him. So I don't know. There's, there's the flare. So what he wants you to do is he wants you to drive over this. Now you don't apparently don't have to, but that might be. A quicker way of doing it or not it's just a thing but like like for instance right now I hear something somewhere he's saying did I even see it no it's just a suggestion at least that's how it was last time I didn't have I, I don't think you have to touch everything where is the way out? Oh, around the other side oh there we go And they're all pretty close. This is very similar to the weed sale stuff. And that the stuff, once you get rolling, it's close. Really, I guess, you know, almost the garbage truck routes, too. See, like, there should be a hint somewhere, but I didn't see the hint. So is that the fastest method? Probably not, but hey. You really have to be on the bridge. Oh, there you see, that was the way they wanted you. Or this, this is the way you want to go now. Oops, sorry. 
I don't think I killed her. I think I just messed up her day. This is familiar territory around here, isn't it? Your, your brakes aren't great on this thing. They're, they're not bad, but they do they tend to go a little bit further than... I'm expecting to see smoke at some point through here, because you'd think this would be the... Yeah, there you go. So it's like a suggestion. It's not like hard and fast. They don't hold you to it. Maybe originally they did, and it was like, you know... Now, if in any way, shape, or form you think, well, Lee, this is kind of tedious to nothing, nothing compared to the uh, the air sail missions. Oh, my goodness. And some of those you could outright fail easy. Easy. You can see, like, for a lot of these, I'm not even seeing any kind of suggestion. And the first time I did, I'm, like, hunting around for them. I'm trying to find them. No, just go do it. Just go and do it. Come on. I still got 13 minutes left. We're, we're doing fine here. We're at 7 to 10. Maybe they wanted you to go through an alleyway. How does one get in there? Oh, there you go. There's an opening. There's a couple openings. Oh look, oh no drive through here. Well yeah, we can drive through there. That's not a problem. That is a little quicker. There you go. See? One more. Now is this like KO Perico quick as far as making lots of money? Eh, probably not, even on double money. But like I said, I'm doing it for the hat. And I don't like doing Kayaparico, but I don't mind these. So we should not eat this into the ocean. That would be a problem. Okay. Okay, there is a fence, so that's good. But, you know, would it hold? Thank goodness it's the 4x4 version of it, you know? We can back it in, I guess, but that, that was quicker. Leave the area. Easy peasy. And Yaron gets his cut, and we get our hat. Well, the buyer is impressed. He'll be contacting us in the future. Good work. Okay, so then we can, we want we can. Go back. Watch, watch the other stuff up here. Now, here's one more crate. For, I have one more crate I have to sell on the other character, too. But, I mean, I'm still going to be doing these. I think in the... I'll have some time, I think, in the doble money time period to crank up some money. But we back here. We back to 101. 102 and a half. Not too bad. Then we're not... I don't know when I'll get back to my heady... I mean, maybe that counted. I don't see... He's sitting there waiting. Maybe we're sold out. Maybe nothing. Maybe I spent 25k for nothing. Yeah, nothing or nothing. Nothing from nothing. It's nothing. 
you got to have something if you want to be with me. Okay, that's enough of that. And on that note, ladies, let's go get some snacks. Reload our snacks. Reload all our free snacks. On that note, ladies and gentlemen, there you have it. That's, you know, how the the new smuggler stuff is going, the new smuggler's missions. I don't see why you'd ever go back to any of the air stuff, unless you're just really into it. But, I mean, you know, that stuff's way more tedious. This is a much better way to make money. I think they, they, they finally made the uh, the hangar a little bit more lively and a little bit more profitable. Maybe a lot more lively, a lot more profitable. But you know what? Still want the cars back, Rockstar. But I'm back on the website. Stop that. No more FOMO. Not letting that go. On that note, ladies and gentlemen, this is your Black Knight. Have a great night.